Hello, it's Dominique. Today I'm sharing with you a small project, but I've made five of them. Uh, it's called the uh, Bag and Envelope Insert from Paper Crafter 45 video. Uh, you have the tutorial. First is the um, assembly, and then it's all the matting. So you have two different videos. So I followed that video, but I've changed a few uh, things in it. So I'm going to show you this one first. This is the first one I made. Uh, so they have, they don't have this little flap here uh, with the magnet because I wanted to make them more like a little wallet more than an insert. I've done the insert in the last uh, baby album, uh, Baby Mine, the baby girl album I just made uh, yesterday. You'll see it, but I've changed it so that I can just uh, have those by themselves. So here I use the Princess uh, Paper Collection from um, Prima Marketing, I think. Uh, so I've got a princess, I put some stickles here, and I've mounted this little card that I had with a uh, twine on a piece of chipboard. And in the back is just this piece here. So in the back it opens like this. So you have photo mats here, and this is a pocket. And here you have, it's, called, it's glued on. So here is a pocket here. And what you do is you open here. First on this side, so this is made with a paper bag and an envelope. So the envelope is right here and the paper bag is all here. And then you add this part here to make it as large as the, uh, the rest of the paper bag. And you mat everything. So here you have the end of the paper bag, so you have an envelope here. And then uh, you can put lots of things in there. Here you have a, the envelope. The, the top part of the envelope so it's a pocket here and it opens like this I made a belly band here and you have a pocket here another pocket here and a pocket here so they're cute you can put lots of photos if you go somewhere and want to bring a couple photos for to show someone or you're going on holidays and you can't go without your grandchildren's photos <laughs> so you can put them in there and carry that with you it really doesn't take any room in your luggage so this is the first one I made then I made this one with uh, hmm, what's the name of the paper collection I forget anyways it's a 12 by 12 pad it's really thick cardstock also one thing I added because I wanted it to be more like a wallet is I added a gusset here because I don't do any gusset on the video uh, of course I did a gusset here for the, the opening and I also did a gusset here on this flap here so that we can put stuff and it doesn't get all cramped and uh, not closing properly. So this is it. I used the stickers also that I had bought to match this uh, paper collection. They don't go together but I thought they were pretty much the same color so I decided to use them here. That's the reason why I bought the paper collection too. I mean the stickers. So it opens here. So here you have a wallet. And here you have the envelope, not a wallet, I mean a, a pocket. Here I made this little belly band, and then I put a sticker on it, and then I have these cute little tags that I made, just for fun. I don't do nothing with them, it's just decorative mostly. So you have the envelope here, it opens here like this, you have a belly band here. And I made another belly band here, so you have another pocket here I added. And you have this here, and another pocket right here. And you have this pocket right here as well. It goes like this. And this one here opens for photo mats, and another pocket here. So that's pretty much fun. I'm sure a little uh, 10 year old would love to have that. Put some photos of her friends. Uh, then I make, I make this one. This is from the paper collection called uh, Once Upon a Time. The 12 by 12 sheets. Again, they're pretty sturdy. So I use this, uh, I put some uh, stickles here on the letters, magic. So it opens like this. So you have the envelope here, or the pocket. Envelope here. I put a magnet here. They all have a magnet, by the way. And you have the envelope here. And this is just decorative. Open this. I made this little pocket here, kind of tuck some photos in there. So, again, you have this here and this here, two pockets, and another one here. And here in the back, little mat, little mat, and this is a pocket as well. So, you can add whatever you want. Like 
like uh, they show you the video on how to make it it's the basic uh, way to do it but you can add whatever you want this is that if you want to insert it in a in an album you have to have a pretty big pocket for that this one I used uh, oh I don't have the name of the paper collection but anyways by the way I will uh, put a link down um, in the comments of the uh, the paper crafter 45 uh, bag and insert I mean envelope and uh, paper bag in uh, insert tutorial so you can follow it it's really fun to make so here this is one of the kind of the titles there was a 12 by 12 sheet of all sorts of words so I just cut this one and I kind of cut, cut it crooked here and I mounted it on a piece of chipboard and I added this little key and here I put a a different paper piece here and then I just added these little uh, trim from Hobby Lobby little roses in the back here again this is a just decorative so again I mounted it on the chipboard and I didn't tear I just cut it all crooked and this is the back so here you have a pocket and here you have a pocket again so you can kind of tuck photos there and then they will never fall because it's it's holding this way that's why I put it here instead of down here and here you have this magnet again and I made a pocket here put a couple of uh, I just had this piece of paper I thought was nice so I decided to, to distress it by the way I distressed uh, all with uh, Tim Holtz distressing ink and here you have again with the magnet a pocket uh, an envelope here opens belly band here pocket here pocket here and pocket here pocket here and this is a little pocket to, to put a little ticket whatever and last one not the least this is my favorite paper collection is the romance novel from uh, Prima Marketing I think yeah it is so I put a lot of uh, little decorations I uh, cut out this uh, little piece of um, one of the cutouts message so you can write something there. Perfect day I've mounted on a piece of chipboard and then another piece of paper and another piece of chipboard and this is a little envelope. I put a couple of tags in there. It's just for fun. You don't really use them for anything. Anyways, it's in there. <laughs> cards so this is the little envelope that is one of the cutouts and then I added this little piece of uh, cutout and in the back you can put some message here and here I cut out these two little lists of things you can put there in the pocket and belly band here again with the magnet should put a piece of paper right here I'll do that and again an envelope here this is a tuck place for photo and you can write some stuff here you can write stuff here here too journaling this is magnetized and I put a couple of little cutouts again so things you can write down put a little photo in here so cute so this is the envelope and opens here I made a place here all the way down here and this is just decorative it's mounted on a piece of chipboard and you have this envelope right here and another one here and another one here so those are really fun to make so that's why I make so many and they please a lot of people love them so I hope you liked it if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet you can do it uh, right now and then uh, if you like the video you can uh, give thumbs up and also you can visit my uh, Facebook page which is called scrapbooking freak so we see you later bye bye